hello guys welcome to today's video by trust stanley and this is a ts tech talk video guys on today's video i'm going to be explaining a particular feature of um youtube for you while uploading your video so while uploading your video there is this particular feature that displays and ask you a particular question and asking if this particular content is actually related to a particular user so i'm going to actually explain that thing for you and then show you example and how it works so let's dive into that now let's go ahead and open the YouTube application. And now I'm going to try to upload a particular video. I'm going to click on this plus icon, select upload, and I'm going to upload this first video I created right here. So um, I'm going to give this video a name. Um, so um, this is actually the first thing they will ask you and then the next thing is actually this visibility option so i'm going to choose public because i want it to be published and also i'm going to click on next and then this is actually the question that is asked for everybody and most people actually do not understand this now it says select your audience now when it, it says select your audience actually um this does a lot of things if you choose this option on my on all my video this is actually the option i choose no is not meant for kids and there is actually a particular reason for that but if you choose this particular option that says yes is made for kids um something different is going to happen let's go ahead and publish this video and you guys will see what will happen so go ahead and click on upload and then um let the video upload but then for some reason guys i prefer uploading um it's not meant for kids even though that particular content is made for kids um youtube is actually going to find a way to recommend them for kids so you do not need to worry about if um kids are also going to see those videos do not worry about it it's also going to be recommended for kids but just say um just choose any other option you want out of those two but my preferred option is no is not meant for kids so let's wait for it to publish and then um i'm going to explain them for you playing the video and then showing you guys how it works all right guys um this i've actually completed and this is a video right there so let's go ahead and test this video and see how it plays so um when you notice right there where it says your video you should see the last video i uploaded this is a video three minutes ago so when i click on the particular video to play um you will notice the first thing you notice is actually it said um uh it says try youtube kids an app made for kids so which means this particular app is made for kids and i can use youtube kids to watch this particular video and then um another thing you need to notice about this particular feature is that the comment is actually turned off which is actually one of the main reason why i do not use that particular option it leaves your comment turned off because so, for some reason youtube actually disabled comment section for contents that are made for kids just in order for them not to um, get abusive on the platform and so that it's going to control the user friendly and then um, another thing you need to notice is while playing the video right now if you go back it just um, says mini player is off for videos made for kids which is um, actually the reason why it paused the video. So you need to click on that, play the video till it complete before going away from that particular um, area. But normally, if you are playing a video that is um, not made for kids, you can go back and then search anything you want and then play them. But for some reason, this particular feature or this option um, do not allow you to go away from the particular player until you finish playing the video so um guys let me go ahead and change this on uh timeline and you will see how it works properly so i'm actually going to close that youtube application and then i just opened um youtube studio right now just in case you do not know about it it's actually a youtube studio you can go ahead and search and download it on the youtube application click on the particular video i just uploaded and then click on the pencil icon to edit it and now you notice where it says audience just go ahead and click on that on your own end and i'm going to go ahead and say no it's not made for kids and then i'm going to go right back and then click on save and once it's save, we can now go ahead and start playing the video all over so wait for it to load up and then go over to the library once again and go to your videos and then play that particular video and you see how it plays so currently you notice the comment has been automatically enabled and also 
when I go back, the video keeps playing. I just pause the video so that my voice will be heard. So um, this actually works perfectly well. And this is the reason why it plays normal. So if for some reason you are watching um, a YouTube video and you notice the comment is not displaying, the reason is because it's under non made for kids or the person actually disabled the comments because you can also disable comment for any reason on your video. But most times, if you are the person that owns the video and you uploaded it, and then for some reason, the comment option is not enabled, this is actually the reason. So if this video helped you guys a lot, please smash like and subscribe to the channel for more video. Guys, I will see you on my next video. Please stay safe and peace.